Iraq's leader, Mustafa al-Qadimi, vowed on Sunday to expose those behind an attack on his life. The Prime Minister escaped unharmed after armed drones targeted his residence in Baghdad's Green Zone. Security sources told Reuters six of his guards were wounded in the attack. No one has yet claimed responsibility. Shortly after the incident, Qadimi's office published a video of him chairing a meeting with top security commanders. We will continue to search for the perpetrators of this heinous crime, which they committed yesterday, by targeting the residence of the Prime Minister. We will search for the perpetrators, and we know them very well. We know them well. We know them well. We will find them surely. The attack has dramatically raised tension in Iraq, weeks after a general election that's drawn the scorn of militia groups backed by Iran. They lost much of their power in the election, dispute the results, and have led protests and complaints about it. On Friday, there were violent clashes between government forces and supporters of the Iran-backed political parties. The United States, United Nations, Saudi Arabia and Iran have all condemned the attack on Iraq's leader.